for the third part of the Let's Simulate to Elucidate activity in the Gateway Curriculum, Activity 3.1, it asks you to open use OpenSim for risk analysis. Here's a quick rundown of how to do that. You go to File, Open Model. Uh, you will need to go find where OpenSim is located. That's Local Disk, OpenSim 3.3. Models, and we're going to open up RIST model. We're going to open up RIST.OSIM. That gives us this look right here. Now, in the instructions, they want you to get a little closer in on the hand. So, we want to either use your wheel to roll in and out, or if you click and hold the right mouse button and then push the mouse forward and back it will allow you to zoom in and then you just arrow down or up to move the hand back into alignment with the hand there or in the directions it's got a little bit farther out probably closer to this area but I want to zoom in a little more so that we can really see the hand movement here it says to open up the coordinates and then you've got lots of options down here to see different wrist movements so we can see how the the wrist there at the elbow this is actually the elbow so maybe it's important to come back out a little farther you can see how the elbow bends there with the tendons let me come in a little closer this is how it twists so your hand can kind of rotate in and out the wrist going back and forth and again we can uh, look on the back here Watch your individual fingers move at each joint. Some movement. And wrist movement. To go back to your default, again, you can go back here. I ask you to observe the deviation and the flexion of the wrist and the flexion of the thumb and fingers. Uh, it talks about these are being affected most in patients with cerebral palsy. Patients will experience difficulty flexing their thumb, fingers, and wrist, which in turn affects their ability to grasp objects. There's then a short video that shows how the hand picks up different objects. That is pretty good. Video there also shows how the extraction of the muscle tendons are in length depending on different objects that are being picked up.